what are the environment variables I need to set uh, in my machine to run Java? So the answer is none. You don't need to set anything. But when you set it, your life become a little simpler. So that's the thing. The first is path. Okay. So the path, as I said, you can run without setting it or you can set it just to make it convenient. So what it does is like a path variable is a environment variable. So where it points to the where your Java C, Java compiler interpreter, all those things are there. Okay. So that is the purpose of path variable. So instead of uh, let's assume you are in a, if you want to run Java C, you should always go to Java bin wherever it is. Uh, if it is a C colon or a D colon or uh, if it is from the root, you have to go there and then run it. Instead of that, can I run it from a different location? Yes. If you want to run it, you have to set the path as simple as that. Okay. The second is the class path. The class path is a variable which tells the application to include the JDK tools or the standard class files where it will be. Okay. That is one thing. And if you have any custom class files or jar files which you want to include, you can include by using a CP command. Okay, so instead of setting the class path, like you can pass the um, data in the CP command as a argument and then use it. Okay, this is how you should use it. Java C, CP or class path, whatever it is. And then uh, the class path where your um, custom library is set and then your Java class file. Okay. In Java, uh, I mean, not only in Java, in any programming language, you should always understand the oper operator precedence of it. Okay, who gets the highest priority? Always postfix or prefix operators gets the highest priority and followed by the unary operators. And also there is also another thing called associativity. So left to right or right to left. This is another key thing. You will find a lot of problems uh, uh, in uh, during the interviews uh, surrounding these things. So given an expression, how do you evaluate it? Like, so for that, you should know uh, the precedence as well as the associate duty. The associate duty is like left to right or right to left. Okay. So those two things you should know it. So what is bit shifting? So there are three bit shifting, shifting operators. Okay. So right shift as well as left shift. The only difference is the, uh, I mean, trip, double shift and triple shift. Uh, so double shift is like a, I mean, uh, when I say double shift, double uh, angular basis. So what it does is like, a, uh, it just shift the bits, right? Nothing else it does. Uh, the, whereas a second triple shift, it shifts and also fills with uh, zero. For example, if I have a data of 30, whose uh, variable is like this, 